An East County city is considering some new high tech ways to fight crime and using the help of the sheriff's department. It's a program that's already up and running in another local city. Fox 5's Jason Sauce is live in Santee with more on this. Hi, Jason. Hey, good afternoon. Well, the city of Santee is considering a camera system through the sheriff's department to help protect the community. This mall is a good example of where this program could work. A lot of businesses, a lot of people around spots where criminals look for opportunities, also parks and trails uh, to help with the security in spots like those. This program, dubbed Safe Santee, would give the sheriff's department the ability to connect with public and privately owned camera systems, giving them instant access to video of what's going on in real time. Santee's considering this program after hearing about how things have worked with the same program in Lemon Grove, Dub Safe Lemon Grove, the Sheriff's Department got that up and running a year ago. Now, the program is designed so that when a crime happens in areas with cameras, deputies get a call and through their phones or computers, they can get instant video and a look at what's going on in the area, possibly help them with a suspect or victim, and to help them better respond to an incident. The idea is this will help protect residents and law enforcement and could prove very useful in investigations. We talked with Santee Mayor John Minto, who says he likes what he sees so far. The sheriff has dispatched, let's say, to a disturbance of some kind. They may be able to uh, tap directly into that camera and see what's happening before the sheriff gets there. That way they know how urgent it is, and they also know that the sheriff might be able to approach from a different way so that it's safer for everybody that's going there. Choose to join the program if they wish. It hasn't gone that far down the road just yet. The city council will discuss it more in a meeting next month. Also, a lot of privacy issues to consider. We'll have more about that coming up later on the Fox 5 News at 4. Live in Santee, Jason Sloss, Fox 5 News. Jason.